Hi guys, welcome to this video looking at the difference between concentrated and dilute acids. Okay, so if I had a litre of water, if we want to talk about what the difference between concentrated and dilute means, it's all to do with the number of particles in there. So when we're talking about acids, it's to do with the number of hydrogen ions. So if we look at a concentrated ion here, you can see there are lots and lots of H plus ions in there, hydrogen ions, so we class that as concentrated. If I go to a dilute one, there won't be as many in there. I've still got a litre of water, one decimeter cubed, but there are less hydrogen ions, therefore we class that as dilute. So what this means is the more acid particles there are in there, the more concentrated it becomes, and the more acidic, which also means that the pH will be lower. So a dilute acid, which has less particles in, will become less concentrated, and will have a higher pH, closer to pH of 7, which is neutral. So in summary, the higher the concentration of an acid, the more hydrogen ions it has. The higher the concentration, the more acidic it is, and the lower the pH. So therefore, a concentrated acid will have a lower pH than a dilute acid. Right, let's have a look at a few questions then. So question one, describe what happens to the acidity and pH of an acid as more hydrogen ions are added, which is worth two marks. Question two, explain why the pH of hydrochloric acid increases as pure water is added. Two marks as well. And then question three, explain what would happen to the pH of a neutral solution if pure water was added. Also two marks. Pause the video, have a go, and we'll see how I've done in a minute. Okay, hopefully you've gone through that. Let's have a look. So question one was describe what happens to the acidity and pH of an acid as more hydrogen ions are added. It's worth two marks. Your first one is for saying it becomes more acidic. So the more hydrogen ions you have, the more acidic it becomes. Then you need to talk about the pH, which will decrease or go down. And finally, that's because there's a higher concentration of hydrogen ions. Question two. Explain why the pH of hydrochloric acid increases as pure water is added. If you increase the amount of water, there's a lower concentration of hydrogen ions. There's more water, less hydrogen ions in the same area. And then if there are fewer hydrogen ions, the higher the pH and less acidic the solution. Question three. Explain what would happen to the pH of a neutral solution if pure water was added. Nice and simply, if it's already neutral, You've got the same number of hydrogen and hydroxide ions, so nothing will happen. So your first mark, it would stay the same. And your second mark, there would still be an equal number of hydrogen and hydroxide ions, meaning nothing will happen. Okay, that brings this video to an end. There is a review question, which is explain how to change the acidity and pH of hydrochloric acid, which is a concentrated acid with a pH of 1. Hi guys, hope you enjoyed the video, if you did click on subscribe down below and you can also find out more information on my website mrbarnstc.com and Facebook and Twitter.